Welcome to this edition of Using Practice Score. Hey, you've done great work. Uh, you created a match. Uh, you got the word out to everybody to sign up. You've uh, created a number of stages which you've uh, loaded to this match and everybody's uh, registered and you're uh, getting ready to go here. Uh, so uh, well done. Uh, besides, you watched all the videos that I made previously. But now we want to talk about how we take advantage here of all that we've created uh, on the internet, uh, on the PC or whatever you want to call it there, and how do we do download it so we can use it uh, in a practical way on the range when we're going around, walking from stage to stage and shooter to shooter and recording all the scores and penalties and bonuses and all that sort of stuff here. So uh, probably might have to break this up into uh, two videos simply uh, for the time span here and so you can only watch what you're interested in but what we're going to do uh, this particular uh, Chromebook that I'm using is uh, a dual purpose it's both going to uh, get the uh, match that we set up and it's going to download it to itself uh, you might prefer as we do at our club uh, we've got our matches set up on our uh, uh, Windows 10 PC and we have separate uh, devices, uh, second, uh, secondary devices, tablets, as well as uh, a Chromebook there that we download from the internet to these uh, tablets. And that, that's where we get the, the real work done uh, on the tablets here. So do whatever you think uh, is best when you're uh, doing this. Uh, so let's uh, go on and uh, go to our match here, our cloned uh, test match here. Click the blue uh, manage button. And down near the bottom here, you can see the practice pin number, practice pin. So I want to tap on that. And when we clone this match or a real match, whatever the case may be, practice score creates a unique match pin number. As you can see it there, uh, Victor Alpha Echo Lima Uniform Alpha. Make a note of that and we're going to uh, use that match pin when we uh, download uh, the information. And how do I do that? Well, let me launch the practice score app here on this uh, Chromebook. And here's a uh, practice score in the app format. I'm going to go to uh, import export and I want to get the match registration. And I tap on that and now let's tap in that unique pin number. Uh, it's never going to have numbers in it. Uh, it's always uh, letters, usually six letters, and that's the case. So I've got my uh, pin uh, there, and I just need to tap the download bar, and it's loading the match. There it is. And I want to uh, apply the changes, and I'm good to go on that. And let me go over here and uh, keep backing up. And there it is uh, on this particular device. And again, it could be a tablet. In this case, it's actually a Chromebook here, and I'm all set. And uh, if you can read it here in the highlights under uh, Edit Shooters uh, Squads, I've got 12 shooters and a total of five squads. Well, I don't think I'm going to run five squads. I think with 12 shooters, I'm just going to divide it up into uh, six and six, and we'll go from there. Uh, but before I do that, let me show you here about building the stages. And there are the stages. I don't know if you saw the other video, but I uh, loaded myself uh, five uh, different stages here. They all had uh, PDF files and so forth like that. And uh, let's say uh, I don't have all the stages that I want or we want a, a six stage or something like that. You can see the add stage button. I'm going to tap that just so you get a look at it. So I could add a stage six. That's really nice if you need it. So uh, I'm going to uh, cancel that and back here to the stages. But I am going to uh, uh, add something here uh, where I'm going to edit uh, uh, the, the stage. And to do that, just click over here the three buttons. Uh, I don't know, you wouldn't have seen my thumb touch it, but I touched the edit, and I'll touch edit here. And uh, there's the uh, situation. Uh, there's a the diagram right there at the top center of your screen, you can see that, a little pictorial and so forth like that. And if I wanted to add additional strings, can you look down the left-hand margins, stage name, scoring type, strings. Now the default for our club, the way it's set up is just one string, but if you need to have two or more strings, let's just tap that. I'll 
take that out and I'll just tap that in. And so they would be shooting this particular stage in three separate strings based on the stage description and we're all set. So let's uh, scroll down here a little bit. Here are all the different uh, penalties that we've got set up uh, in regards to our uh, matches, uh, all the different uh, situations here. Now, uh, in this case, I don't want all of those bonuses to appear. We're not going to be using any of those bonuses, so I'm just tapping the little box here, taking them out. There you go. Uh, just got all those, uh, and we've got our penalties, and we're all set uh, and good to go. Uh, just go down here at the bottom and click the Save, and we're all set. So uh, if you want to edit the penalties, here we go on the penalties. So you can set this up, uh, whatever the uh, case might be, uh, including uh, down, you can see down at the uh, very bottom there, you can be a doom cough and you give the person 300 seconds. That may be somebody that's uh, shooting with unapproved gear or uh, uh, situation there that you want to just take them out of the match altogether and give them 300 seconds. And I think that would effectively uh, eliminate them from the competition. So we've uh, edited the penalties as necessary. And if you want to add in some uh, extra bonuses, uh, recently uh, we had a match where the uh, match director uh, threw in a clay pigeon, if you would hit the clay pigeon. So uh, I'm going to add uh, something here. Let's see, I'll take out the one second, but I'll give them a 10 second bonus. Uh, and I'll just tap in here and hit clay pigeon. On first shot, kind of easy here. Could uh, spell things a little better here. <laughs> anyway, you'll do, you'll do just fine on that. So. We added a 10 second penalty, excuse me, 10 second bonus if you hit the clay pigeon on the first shot. And I'm just going to add that bonus here. And we're all set. Um, take that out and go to back here and, uh, and all. Anyway, so we've got the five stages. Uh, we're all set to go. And uh, on a separate video here, I'm going to show you this business about editing shooters and squads. Uh, so we'll uh, take it here and we'll uh, manipulate uh, the various names that you see here and we'll make it all happen in the next video. So uh, what we've done, just a quick review, is we've got uh, this uh, match pin number and we loaded it to a particular device. Uh, I've done it uh, simultaneously, uh, both uh, the PC as well as the uh, primary uh, device here, uh, but what we haven't done yet is adding this uh, or transferring this match registration, syncing as they call it, uh, from this uh, primary device to the secondary devices, and we'll do that in the next video.